Governments around the world have been experimenting on how to incorporate drones to mitigate against the coronavirus. During the outbreak in China, the government deployed drones to warn people off of the streets, sometimes by following them all the way home. Chinese companies are the world leaders in drone technology, but their use in this pandemic has gone worldwide. It's also raised questions about privacy and state surveillance. Here in Hong Kong, the government encourages us to work from home. I conducted these interviews remotely over the internet. I've also self-isolated during these turbulent times. In South Korea, the local government has been working with the drone company DJI to disinfect the streets of Sungnam, a city half an hour outside of the capital. South Korea has been praised for its response to COVID-19. They've adapted drones used for agriculture to spray disinfectant from the sky. They call this drone quarantine. Drones can be effective and precise in areas where humans can't easily reach because they can spray disinfectant from a height where humans are not able to reach. Drones are also more suitable for disinfecting things like trees. And because it can spray from two to four liters a minute, it's very effective. These drones were developed originally for the use in agriculture. They have multiple nozzles that sit underneath motors controlled by wireless powered handsets. Its FPV camera allows it to transmit data back to the pilot. Here in Sangnam, they say they can disinfect an area 10 times faster with drones than with people. With the progress being made with artificial intelligence, DJI believes it's just a matter of time before we see automated drones helping with everyday life. But it's not just DJI using drones to disinfect. At the height of the outbreak in mainland China, other drone companies like XAG employ drones to disinfect urban areas. XAG's R80 agriculture robot has also been deployed on the ground. It can spray disinfectant at 360 degrees and is controlled by a wireless transmitter. In South Korea, the city plans to wider deploy drone quarantine. This may be social distancing 2.0.